Hey guys, so today we are going to get a bit of a yoga workout by working your normal, ordinary Surya Namaskars into Namaskar Burpees. So we're going to build it up slowly and maybe throw in an arm balance or two. And for this arm balance, you can actually just go into your regular Chaturanga push-ups or you can take this challenge of the arm balance push-up. So what you need today is maybe water and a towel beside you and of course a yoga mat or any mat you can use. So let's get started. So today I chose to roll on the glutes. I chose this small roller because it's more targeted as tightness in the glutes can sometimes cause sometimes cause pain in the outer thighs, maybe around the hips, so I like smoothening in the mouth so then I get the best of my workout. Okay, so I put it on one side and then on the other side. But if you have the straight big roller, you can just roll on both sides simultaneously. So here goes. So we'll just sit in a comfortable position. Start with maybe closing your eyes, softening your face, softening your chest, the sides of your body. And begin to inhale in through the nose and out through the nose. And full breaths to get you started. Maybe it would be nice to think about something you're thankful for or 10 things you're thankful for. chest up, try to touch your to the ankles, press the chest up, and we go on all fours, straight up for downward facing dog, 
take a few breaths here and then go right foot in left foot to follow slowly rise up arms up and then go hands to your heart center and we begin Surya Namaskar A so we variate this one by just dropping your knees your chest and your chin instead of your regular Chaturanga if you don't feel like doing your regular one today step the right foot in and the left foot to follow wow. straighten the spine before you bow forward and go reach up look up hands to your heart so on the next one we do Surya Namaskar in regular Chaturanga so here you straighten the spine Explore Surya Namaskar in Ashtangasana again just to get you to feel what you like better. That's dropping your knees, your chest, and your chin. Reach up, cobra, exhale, down dog. Put between the knees and step the right foot, the left foot forward, straighten the spine, fold forward. Inhale again, reach up, and exhale, hands to the heart. So find what works for you. Go Surya again. So this one, we're going to add helping towards the back for your mat, Chaturanga, Cobra, and Down Dog. So be ready, decide whether you walk or you hop this way to the front of your mat. And we go reach up again, look up, and swan dive two more times on your own. Remember to breathe and do what you can. For this one, you widen your legs, inhale, reach the arms up, and squat onto Malasana. Palms down, one leg back, the other leg back, Chaturanga, Cobra, and go down with facing dog. We can walk outside the hands, reach up from that squatting position, and go down again, legs back, Chaturanga. Cobra, down dog. Walk the foot outside the palm and the other foot to squat back into Mulasana. And then reach up and squat back in. Palms down, legs back, Chaturanga. Cobra, down dog. And you know how to go back. Just squat into Mulasana and stand up. Go hands to your heart. So take a moment to breathe, pause, or maybe even hit that pause button before we get ready for Namaskar Burpees. So Malasana to jump up to Chaturanga, hip back, hop forward, jump up, and repeat. Make sure you go light when you hop back and hop forward. Engaging the core, make sure you're breathing. It's nice to actually inhale when you go up, exhale when you do go down, and keep yourself hopping forward and back. Light on your feet, keeping the breath in.
hold forward, breathe, breathe the heartbeat down, just mindfully begin to lengthen the legs, you can put your palms over the feet, deepen the pose, most importantly you breathe. your palms gripping the floor looking back or see if you can slightly bend that left leg and go hip back five times like when we were doing the core exercises a while ago and you get the option to go eight angle pose and maybe do arm balance push-ups or you can just go your regular push-up position in plank pose and then just go up and down a few times to get that arm workout and on to the other side grab the left leg right leg stabilizes and grounds onto the floor as you look up with your spine straight Your hips stable, looking past 
you may decide to go just plank pose in this position and go do your push-ups or do the arm balance push-up. And we're good. Close your eyes and you breathe. 